Who won the flower show this year? <laughs> uh, well, the flower show 2020, a bit controversial because it was nearly cancelled over lockdown. All the flower shows like the RHS, so it was all cancelled. Um, but the judges did end up going around people's gardens on individually socially distanced walking circuits. Um, but the event was officially cancelled, but people did get honorary um participation awards um but there was no overall winner this year sorry mason but it was less disappointing <laughs> mason's other question was how are the vampire nightclubs faring in the age of social distancing not well <laughs> so um obviously all the nightclubs are closed because of lockdown um, vampire run cafes which are the 24-hour ones they're now not 24 hours obviously they're observing curfew rules so that's kind of screwed that up a bit takeaway only staff have been furloughed um, vampires tend to have really good communal resources so they don't have to really worry about the funding to furlough staff but um, it's actually, that's not the issue. Um, the issue is, so there's this one club called the Twilight, which used to be called the Twilight Zone. So if you're of a particular generation, you'd still call it the Zone. But now it's changed hands and it's called the Twilight or the Twilight Club or just Twilight, depending on which demographic you are, I guess. Um, so, yeah, so Twilight has a really bad track record with underage clientele and non-consensual feeding and drink spiking with blood. Um, so it's no surprise that the vampires who are known to frequent this club are the same ones, now that the club is closed, who are engaging in very bad practice over lockdown because their main hunting grounds are um, sort of no longer uh, in, in like, yeah. So, uh, yeah, so they, they, so bad practice would be um, to get a willing donor to come into your bubble and then not tell them that you're actually part of a nest. So you invite somebody over to be your donor over lockdown and then they actually end up in a situation where they're being rationed out across like this entire um, group rather than just you. So that's bad practice. Um, also attacking dog walkers, joggers, people going on their walks, um, that they're allowed they're the daily exercise walks that we're allowed to do um so that's also bad practice so it's again so, so yeah it's there's a correlation between the vampires who go to the twilight and those that have been defanged um and there's been a few cases where um vampires in pagamon have actually had their fangs ripped out um as a you know like like a, a to be made an example of basically by the authorities <laughs> 